Hi, this is Dr. Gary. Welcome to the Daily Tune-Up today. Let's talk about your ego today. You know, that voice inside of yourself that tells you that you're okay, and if someone says something to you that you don't particularly like, it seems to flare up and defend you, even your incompetencies. You see, ego is a good thing sometimes. However, most of the time, it's not. It gets in the way of us growing. It causes us to stay the way we are. Have you ever known someone who bought a car and the car was a complete piece of garbage and you ask them how they like the car and they say, oh, it's great, even though they knew it wasn't? They're saying that because they do not want someone else or even themselves admitting that they made a mistake. And keep in mind, mistakes are not mistakes. Mistakes are feedback. And feedback is a useful tool in order for us to continue to learn, to grow, and to become who we're going to become. If your ego is getting in the way, in relationships, in your job, even dealing with your children when you're out in public, work on it. The ego is something that has to be tamed, and there's only one way to tame it, is for you to tame your own ego. Ego is more than just somebody who is conceited, somebody who likes themselves. That's not ego. That can be translated to look like ego, but ego is when we are completely out of control of our own reality and we see it as a perverted example of what reality is. Ego is when things are really worse than we see them and we justify how bad they are so we don't have to do anything or so we do not feel bad about the situation we've created. If your ego is in your way, whether you drink too much, yell too much, eat too much, spend too much, allow your ego to be tamed. The truth of the matter is most people don't care anyway because they're so entied into their ego. They're zeroed in on themselves more than externally on what you're doing. Control your ego, soften up, become a person who loves to grow, face challenges with grace, and allow that to help you become a better person. And you're going to be glad you did because once you tame your ego, life is a lot smoother. So until tomorrow, let's see how you do with that one. This is Dr. Gary wishing you an extraordinary, unego-filled day. Bye-bye.